Hey there, time for another little shop update. So I guess the most obvious thing is that there are more of those uh, body parts all over the place. There's a chest up here and the legs. I can't remember exactly what point in the process everything was the last time the last time I talked to you, but, um, but yeah, this is how it is now. I've been altering things and updating things, and it's totally confusing working with two different types of clay at the same time, but it's okay and it's working out. These hands are being really challenging, um, just because for the most part I'm working without proper reference, and because it's meant to be thumb, thumb, like there's an additional hand coming from behind. Um, that's something that I can't really recreate on my own. Um, so, um, so yeah, I'm having to make up a lot of that as I go along. Um, and it's possible that I'll end up just having to somehow find better reference for that. Um, and, uh, yeah, so some of the different parts. The, um, the easel has been super helpful. I'm glad that, glad that I did that. And, um, and then what else? Oh, I baked this little mushroom guy that I made. Um, over the weekend I was doing a, uh, a little lesson and everybody wanted to make mushrooms. So, let me get some better light here. So I, uh, I just started doing this as a little demo and then the face happened and he's got a little butt. And um, yeah, I'll paint him soon. And I'm, I don't know, I'm excited about him. He's, he's fun. And then um, I've also been making, if I can get that, yep. Yeah, I've been making all these arms. Um, after, what was it? After posting last month's wallpaper um, for some, some of you patrons, um, yeah, it was, it was a, a picture of a bunch of the old arms that I did, and it just, I don't know, it made me think about arms, and I love making them, and I decided it was time to do some, some new ones. Let's see if I can get this to focus here. There we go. Yeah, so there's gonna be more arms. I don't know exactly what I'll do about the, the wall mounting yet. I have some ideas, but... You know, I'm not quite ready to to let to let you know about those things yet. But um, but yeah, there's some some bigger ones as well, um, which I haven't really done before. It's interesting working in all sorts of different scales because you know I started sculpting specifically in Super Sculpey, and um, because of that. You know, I was always making things specifically at sizes and scales that would um, that would fit in uh, in my oven at home, and so that it kind of locked me into certain yeah, I mean certain scales, and all of a sudden I stopped using Super Sculpey and I started making bigger things, but um, just the a lot I guess a lot of the time the scale that would naturally come out of me was, um, you know, that same size. And so, yeah, now working in, you know, life size, and then, you know, this is probably more like, you know, quarter. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's neat to experiment with, with all these different scales. Um, but yeah, that's, that's most of what's going on. I don't know how many more of these arms I'll do. Like, what exactly size the the run will be of individual sculpts but um but yeah i definitely intend to to mold and cast them and do something interesting with them um and i'm sure whatever that is i will keep you up to date as it all happens um yeah so have a great weekend everybody